Hi everybody, it's Saturday, um, been off work today which is great, I think it might be in next Saturday so back to normal hopefully anyway which will be good. So um, me, Steve and Georgia have been out, we've been down to the creme today, it was Steve's mum's birthday so I put some nice flowers down and then we decided we would go to B&M and then where did we go after that? Another B&M because &M, yeah, I didn't have what stretcher. I wanted. Then we went to Pound Stretcher which was back down where with the first B&M was so we've been all over and we've just came back, we've drove up to a housing estate which has um, a lovely house all decorated and that maybe so can put a picture. Yeah, I'll see the end. picture on you. Yeah, yeah, it's lovely and people were bringing their children to have a look. There was two little boys in their pyjamas, they were so excited. It's a very big, posh house. Yeah, yeah, it's lovely though. But uh, I'll show you a few things that I picked up because uh, I think Georgia's doing the Christmas tree tomorrow. So the first thing we picked up was this and I'm thinking about putting it on one of the shelves. That was... Ten pound, and you put a bulb in, and it lights up. You put a bulb in, dear. Uh, battery and even. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Um. The these aren't the lights that I wanted, but um. But I'm thinking I'm going to put them around the stair case. Um. I've got a garland, but I'm not happy with it, so I thought I might just buy some lights and see see how that looks. Steve picked these up because he said they're good for hanging the ornaments off the off the tree. And those are just some sticky things so that we can hang things up. Got a little Christmas, uh, it's like a little Christmas house with a, a plant in that was three fifty from Sainsbury's. And we've got these rope lights that blue, and we're going to decide whereabouts we're going to put them. We're not too sure. Steve thinks around the back of the settee on the floor, so it shines underneath the settee, but. I'm yet to see what it'll look like. Go outdoors as well. Um, these were from Poundland, so there's a Christmas Eve wax melt and gingerbread wax melt. I've never had had a gingerbread one before. So the, what was it? Two for two for a pound or two, two for pounds? Something like that. Yeah. Something like that. I thought, oh, why not? Just give it a go. And then we've got these bells. They are the noisiest things ever. But, Mr. Wright <laughs> likes them. <laughs> um, so we've got those as well. Where were they from, Beanham? Yes. Yeah. And then I always get one of these for Christmas. That was £5. It's actually got a solid um, base to it. And uh, it's quite a nice size, actually. Oh, the tiny one was good. Yeah, the. Uh, the really small one, but was it two fifty three pounds, something like that? Two fifty for the tiny one. Yeah. yeah. So I don't think that's a bad size for a fibre. Yes, uh, got a few ornaments as well. I thought might as well show you them. You know, as a, I haven't got them today. Just whenever we've been at the shop, like Tesco and everything, you know. So just picked one up. So, yeah, I'll show you them. I see you've already seen this in a previous video. Uh, got it from Costa, a nice solid ceramic Costa cup. Yay! And I got this from Tesco, a little winter fox. I think I showed you that as well. They're quite cute, I like it. Billy like Basil Bush. <laughs> uh, we've got a little mouse. Uh, hanging decorations as well. Um, this one, a little wooden tree. It's quite cute, and I don't know if you can make out there. Just there, it says Merry Christmas. And we've got bells. The they're not staying on this tree. They're, they we're just putting them here for now. Keep safe. Got this big, humongous, sort of goldish, glittery. It's more like a bronzy gold, glittery bell, and that was only a couple of quid at Pound Stretcher. It's quite nice. Uh, we've got. This one, Georgia picked this one. I think we've shown you this one as well with the Santa inside and the trees. Uh, and we've just got this from, I think, B&M. It's a G for Georgia. And it's all the stuff inside. It's quite nice. Very nice. And George, 
If anybody's seen on Instagram would have seen this, George has got himself a new jumper. Yeah, he's got his Christmas jumper on, so he's happy. <laughs> so yeah, that's the decorations we've got so far. Like new ones anyway, we've obviously got ones from other years, so it's still packed up, so. Well, we've got the lights not totally finished yet because I need to move. It's plugged in there, so that's going to get changed to the plugs behind the settee. So it's just for the moment. Uh, it goes behind there. And when it's when the lights are off, you can see it glowing under the settee. So the the rope light comes up here. Got it attached to the skirting board. Goes all the way up the stairs there. It looks. Hang on, see if I can adjust the light there. I tell you what, in the dark it's lovely. In the living room, there it's like a nice green glow, sort of like bluey green glow coming off the stairs. It looks really nice. And there's Costa. Hello. <laughs> so I've been doing that. Yeah, looks really nice. I tell you what, personally, I would keep these up here after Christmas as well. Yeah. Hello, boy. Oh, come here. Come on. Yeah. <laughs> Good boy. <laughs> And Denise is getting frustrated because she hasn't got the right screwdriver for that. <laughs> and... <laughs> Tiny little Phillips screwdriver she needs. Anybody shops at Tesco? I mentioned these the other day. I've got these. Carlix Smart Plug. Yay. They're cheap. Half price. Eight quid. I look great. Christmas tree. I have just tried to set one up for them lights. Oh my God. It would not work. I would... I was on the floor for about half an hour, wasn't I? Mm -hmm. Resetting the things, trying over and over again to get it to connect. I was going through Google Home, I was going through the Calyx app, everything. I could not get the thing to connect. Georgia's light bulb, which is a Calyx one, works fine. Apart from the workaround, like I was mentioning, you know, so we've got to mention the room name. Um, but that works. This, I cannot get this to work. Oh, stop. So they're going back and I've ordered some TP Link ones offline. Oh, that's what Chinese takeaway. What do you think? Like it. Right. Da, da, da. That's the new thing I've just put up. This is the star from B and M. Looks really nice. We just know it's actually putting shining stars under the ceiling there. Very nice. I'll pull back a bit. See what it's like. But you're doing the decorating tomorrow and your Christmas yeah. decorations while I'm at work. Yeah. So I won't see what they've done until Monday. I've told her not to, not to show us any photos or anything. So you can't put anything on Instagram because I might see it. Okay. <laughs> not until I've seen it. Yeah. I know you'll be itching to. <laughs> <laughs> yes? Chinese is here, so I'm going. <laughs> <laughs> so anyway, that was just a quick, quick video. Just, yeah. <laughs> so yes, trying to do this here. So we're gonna get something to eat because we're hungry, and it's now half seven. Nearly bedtime. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so we'll get going. Uh, you know, watch this. George will probably watch the dancing on "I'm a Celebrity, Get Me Out of Here," Big Brother thing. Um, then we'll we'll be watching Grey's Anatomy, no doubt, because yeah. yeah, we're busy catching up with that. And yeah, so. Stay safe, everybody. Have a good weekend, whatever you're doing, and we'll catch you in the next one. Take care. Bye. Bye-bye.